Islam. I'm a more. I don't generally do trending topics. R.I.P. Nip. You know, I would let people on the ground like Tariq and Polite that's in L.A. talk on it normally. You know, but when I hear it, Tariq saying they've been doing military drills. You know, we know he was doing the work with Dr. Sabi documentary also. And then now he has this high priced lawyer, you know, who being a lawyer, you know, represented, well, not representing OJ, but prosecuting OJ. So he's a excellent prosecutor to put his reputation on the line in law, something that I know about and say that the guy, Eric Holder, the killer supposedly is not guilty. You know, what kind of lawyer is going to do that? They trying to go King Alfred playing right now and really crank up. This is the kind of stuff you would see. You know, I would expect to see, you know, the response that the hood got when, you know, this brother passed. It's the same kind of response that they was looking for, for Trayvon Martin, Mike Brown, and all these other brothers. But now, you know, what they did, they turned around and they killed Robin Hood. You know, this high priced as super lawyer representing or defending the killer, supposedly, who is viral on tape with many witnesses around shooting somebody. For a lawyer to put his reputation on the line like this makes no sense unless they're planning on letting this guy off. He pled not guilty because they're going to get him off because in L.A., what happened with Rodney King? The hood rose up. That's what they've been wanting for the King Alfred plan to, to kick it off. They need a response. They want the hood to rise up, you know, the whole country to rise up so they'll have an excuse to kick off this King Alfred plan, you know. That's just what it looks like to me. Like, it's hard for me as a more that's into politics, that's into law, that knows law, you know, and really knows what's going on to look at this any other way. You know, we got to be careful out here with this one. This situation, mm, to be continued.